Hello, ladies, gentlemen, and the unknown species. Welcome back to Star Ocean, the second story. Quick update before I talk about anything in this game, and, um, before I talk about anything in this episode, uh, I leveled up, as you can see, Claude, I got up to 25. I highly recommend getting him to 25. All guides say you should get him to 25, at least 25. They say 30 is recommended, and I've tried it at a lower level. Um, it is definitely possible to do it at like level 20, maybe 22, something like that. I almost um, beat it at level like 22-ish. I almost beat the third guy, because there's three guys. I beat the first one, the second one, and the third one. I got like 10 or 11 hits on him. That means that he was he probably had like less than 500 HP left. If I was able to get one or two more hits on him, I would have definitely won. Unfortunately, I didn't win, so I trained off screen, and now um, I'm 25. The main thing I need is MP. MP is very, very, very important for this fight. And also, what I did off screen was I ended up getting Mithril to 2 by getting Radar. And how you get Radar is you buy Sensible th 2, Sensibility 2, and you ended up getting Radar after that. And now there's going to be a very long event. This, is, th this part is extremely long, so what I'm going to be doing is in this inn, the main thing is um, Claude and everyone, they go to sleep. Well, they talk in the thing about being nervous and also about Diaz entering the tournament. Then they go to sleep. In the morning, Claude is nervous. And then Selena is like, relax. And then after that, you enter the tournament. So I'm just going to be skipping this cutscene. Okay, now that the, that now, now the next part. Um, oh, by the way, you cannot leave the town after you rest up in this inn you can rest up in other inns and they have some pretty interesting cut they, ha they have like a pretty interesting cutscene when you sleep there so um if you sleep at this inn you can't leave so everything you have to do is enter this tournament and why do i recommend because uh, recommend uh being level 25 is because you can get potentially one of the best weapons in the game for claude and i want that so um, just follow me around here uh, while I talk about this thing. Um, in the tournament, you have to get you have to beat the first three entries. And in order to beat the first three entries, people say that it's best to be level 25 because if you're not 25, um, then you're gonna have a really difficult time doing it. It is they do say it is possible, but it's recommended to be at least 25. And some some guides even say uh, some guides even recommend being 30 because it's pretty difficult. Me when I was doing this, because I actually recorded this a few times trying to do it at a lower level. Uh, I tried to do it at level tw 20, 22 or 20 around 22, and like I said, I got to the last guy and I almost beat him. He had practically any HP left. Maybe if I just timed my my attacks a little bit better, I would have probably won. So. Uh, I didn't want to really try it again because I didn't want to take it on chance So I just did the extra few level ups to gain the extra HP to take more hits and have more MP Which is very important So also you have to talk to this girl to register She you, she takes all of your equipment and then she gives you the equipment that you can use in the tournament And then what happens now is uh, um, The registration lady said that Diaz's weapon has not come in yet because Diaz asked if his weapon came in. Rena was helping find, was helping Diaz find his uh, weapon to use in the tournament because somebody hit it. And then Claude gets extremely jealous because he did not know about this. And then Rena runs off. And then Selena sort of scolds Claude for being, you know, a child. And and that's pretty much what the whole cutscene is about. I want to do this as quickly as possible because this is a very long part. And the you know, when I was recording it, I was recording about a half an hour, 40 minutes, something like that. And I just don't want um, the video to be that long. And I don't want to make it two parts. So I'm doing my best to explain it. The, the story, as, uh, I'm doing my best to explain it. Um, if you want, if you have any questions about the story, just leave it in the comment. And I will do my best to explain it. But if not, just look at a guide. Maybe they can explain it a little bit better. But, you know, if you have any questions, just... Ask in the comments, and I'll try to explain the story as best as possible. I know I'm not really a good ex uh, explainer, but I try. So now that that's over, now what we have to do is just wait in the waiting room, which is this room right here. Um, I'm not really sure what triggers 
the first round what I just do is talk to four people these four people that I just talked to and then the um, a soldier guy comes and says the first match is up we fight that guy in the golden suit and that's round one round one um, I recommend not using any MP because of the fact that he has 2000 HP and all of the times that I fought him I fought him a few times um, two times during recording and then I think two more times without recording at all so um, so so he only has about 2000 HP and he only all the times he, he fought me he only hit me once I think the first time I fought him he hit me twice but that's about it we get um, these things that heal HP and MP really I'm gonna be using them because I'm gonna end up running out of MP probably even getting low on HP and you can see your equipment you don't have anything that you use but you have some pretty nice stuff so also specialties people recommend using um, energy sword but I, ha I don't really see a point in using energy sword I'd rather air slash and head splitter I just think that's better because you do get um, a blackberry which heals MP you get a, some kind of syrup that heals both MP and HP and you get two HP potions so I do think that if you're level 25 and you do plan on winning the first three fights because you have to get to the final round in order to get the weapon I do recommend being 25 because everyone's saying be 25 people say use energy sword but uh, I didn't really find much use in it at all because of the fact that it just wastes MP wastes time that ends up leading to more damage taken so I just think that this is just easier so hopefully I don't get hit at all if possible I would not like to not get hit at all but we'll see how that goes he has about 2000 HP so about 9 or 10 hits will kill him and bam he's done I don't think I took any damage at all so that's really good um, first match is over and now that that's over the crowd cheers for you and then the announcer says congratulations Claude Kenny you have won the first match which is so awesome if I could do it in um if I could do it in a um uh what's it called a a, a an announcer's voice that would be so awesome like congratulations Claude you have won the first match get ready for round two with Claude versus Superman 2.0 anyways what you have to do now is just um, talk to Selena a huge cutscene comes so I'm just gonna skip it alright I just thought I put this match in I'm not gonna be fighting it's it's just gonna be Diaz and Diaz's voice is so freaking cool if you heard it uh, this is Diaz against somebody and I just thought that it'd be it'd be pretty interesting to just to just sew his match because he does a ton of damage and this is really just it's it's really an interesting fight okay um, now let me explain the cutscene that I um, the not the cutscene the, the the dialogue that I just skipped was um, Claude runs to Selena uh, and asks if Rena saw the battle Selena's like no I don't know where Rena is and then they talk Claude's a little depressed because you know Rena didn't watch it but then Rena comes out and is like hey Claude what's up and and um, after that then you the fight that you just saw with Diaz comes up and then after that uh, after the fight um, uh, hold on after the fight then then Claude gets really embarrassed and and with his embarrassment comes a soldier saying that the next match is about to start uh, I didn't exactly want to do that battle the way I did it it's just that I was talking and trying to play and I can't I, I, I when I when I have I don't know I just I'm not I'm not a good I can't multitask I don't know if you guys know this but I can't multitask which means talk about a certain topic and play the game uh, you know talk about something that's not related to the fight like if I was talking about the fight yeah I could do that because that's not really multitasking, that's just talking about the fight. Anyways, after you beat the second boss, the, uh, the, the second monkey guy, immediately afterwards you get the third battle. I have yet to beat this battle, so I don't know what happens after this battle. So, um, what I'm going to quickly do is I saw my HP was low, so I'm going to quickly heal my HP and MP. So, right at the start of, uh, of the battle, I'm going to use the syrup that heals both HP and MP. 
and hopefully I can beat this guy. I'm really hoping I can beat this guy because I'm trying to speed through this as m fast as possible. Uh, stay focused. Stay focused. Got it. Item. Uh, mixed syrup heals both HP and MP. So hopefully I can just use one or two air slashes, and then one. That's a few hits. Doing pretty well. Pretty well. Good on HP. Good on HP still. Not really good on MP. Low on HP. HP comes before MP, obviously. Shoot. 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 No, 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 no. No! Alright. I made it up to this guy again, so we'll see if I can beat the guy again. Alright, let's use a Blackberry. That's, that's not that bad right now. That's not bad. Nothing's going... Nothing's going horribly wrong. Everything's going just perfect. Everything's just going well. Yes! I d Oh, yes! Yes, 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 yes! I did it! 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 I have no idea how to do anything, but I do know that you cannot beat DS. He is the final match contestant. So uh, I think I just have to enter. This is enter. I want your spectate to the side. Oh, I guess I don't enter yet. Um, I guess I'll just speak to Ren Rena. She she probably wants to speak to me. So, so same with Selena. So we'll just speak to Rena and Selena. And let's see what they have to say. You know, hopefully we can just talk to you. Somehow I can't believe it myself. Just as I tap the match championship. I am really happy. You do not know how many times. I had to do that. This I am very happy. Oh my god, I'm so happy. Here he goes. Emmy battle match is the second. This is Diaz. Diaz fighting somebody else. Who he de fighting? Now I'm not going to do anything because I don't take damage. Ha. <sighs> Piece of junk. That's a little rude. Let's see how Diaz fights. See? How does he do that? He's in the middle of an attack, but he still ends up dodging it. And wow. He had he, he that guy had like 1800 HP. And I fight people that have like 4000 HP. Seriously? Diaz has so much HP, so much MP, and he fights these crappy ass people. And then me, I don't even have 2,000 HP. I have like 1,300 HP. That's about 1,200 HP less than he is. So, um, from what I know, it's impossible to beat Diaz. So, anyone who tells me anything about you can beat Diaz, I, it's, it's, you know, anything you've heard. Um, it's impossible unless you use Game Shark. I've heard the only way to beat him is use Game Shark. But, I've also heard that most people that do use Game Shark to try to beat him end up losing anyway. So, it's impossible to beat him, even if you level, even if you train, legitly train yourself up to 100 and and fight him. It's impossible to win. Also, if you cheat and get the strongest weapon in the game and glitch yourself to 100, it's impossible to win. So, it's impossible to win is what I'm trying to say. So don't, don't even try anything. You're never gonna beat him. Don't even try to beat him. You don't even have to beat him. The only ones you have to beat are the three monsters that I've showed you. Well, one of them is sort of a soldier. 
Renna must not have to- Oh god, I'm not even reading this, dude. I should be reading this. I've never gotten this far. What is this promise? You are interesting. You turn so serious when it comes to Renna. But this match is deadly. Is a deadly serious battle. Once we are in the Colosseum, I will not yield even one step. That's exactly what I hope. Alright. People say that Diaz has 8,000 HP. So, I mean, you know, theoretically you should be able to beat him. But, um, everyone is saying that it's impossible to beat him. Maybe he just has infinite HP or something. So... Yeah, um, I have no interest in in uh, even trying to beat him because I don't have to beat him. Alright. I didn't even say anything because you're not supposed to win that match. Alright. Ladies and gentlemen, the winner of this match is Gia, the champion. He came so close. Claude. Claude, Claude. Claude! Wow, I must have taken a huge beating from Diaz to being out for being completely knocked out. I guess it's expected from Diaz, who's supposedly the strongest swordsman ever. I was in the finals. It's over, Claude. Over, but I. Really, Claude, darling, you were only an inch away from winning. Actually, I didn't even touch Diaz. So, <laughs> I don't really think I was an inch away from winning, if you get my drift. Diaz, I don't remember telling you that you can call me by my first name, but no matter. What do you want? I thought I'd expect my appreciate. <laughs> Excuse me, sorry about that. <laughs> oh god. Appreciation? You were more than I expected. It's been a while since the last time I had to get serious. Serious? I didn't even do anything. What? 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 Serious? <laughs> you killed me in one hit. What seriousness was in this battle? Rena, don't, don't pamper him. Keep him at your arm's length for his own sake. What do you mean? I'm going. That's all I have to say. What is it? It was an honor to fight you. We will meet again. Will we meet again? When the time comes, we probably will. Maybe we're about to become friendly rivals. Oh yeah, oh yeah. It'd be kind of interesting to fight him again and actually have a chance to win on it against him. That would be very interesting. Let's get ready to go. That'd be very interesting. I, I kind of hope so. Are you alright, Claude, darling? Yep. Um. I was sleeping for a long time. My body aches, sort of. Uh huh. Interesting. Rena casted a spell on me. Yes. Thank you. Well, let's get going now. Go to Linga. I actually went to Lingo while I was off screen on my training and then some event happened so I ended up restarting the game. I didn't really lose too much progress because I saved a little bit before that so it was rather interesting. Claude! Right. Alright, so since I got second place I, 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 um, I'm gonna get a prize. There'll be a prize for the runner-up, so please 
be sure to stop by the weapon shop you registered okay so let's go quickly go to the guy that we registered um i don't think any events are gonna happen i kind of hope not because this this recording as I, I don't think the video is going to be that long maybe 15 minutes hopefully about 15 minutes maybe the video might be 20 minutes i, I probably will end up being 20 minutes because i do really suck at this game i've been actually recording for about 41 minutes 42 minutes going on so now that we've done that um the monk is right here so let's quickly get our stuff back and everything is the runner up you don't have to be so blunt about it now now no false modesty here thanks for the sales up too all right all right all right all right I got some monies apparently this is for Selena and she's better in a lot of things okay uh I don't think I got the item that I wanted okay well we have to really what I want to just quickly do is just save the game so just hold on one second please while I save the game oh I guess I can't leave let's see right now we're going to linear aren't we yeah so we can get the ancient writings we might be able to find the sorcery globe. I'm, I'm assuming that this that this sorcery globe thing is probably going to be the final boss. Um, so I'm just going to quickly save the game right now. And as you can see, I have a ton of battles, and I've and now I have 102. And look at my playtime now because of the fact that I've been recording for a very long time. But what we want to do is go back over here, and according to the guide. We have to go over here and remember that place that we couldn't enter before or I don't even know if I if I ever showed it but before uh, you couldn't enter here but now you can after the tournament ends and there is a little kid over here and also grandpa Grangri. Rana! This grandpa guy is gonna give me an item. Oh why it's you Rana? I don't know what the point of going inside me and then coming back out of me was. Yep, this is the blacksmith who forged the sword for Dia, Dia as he used in the tournament. The sword that Dia's used? Say, aren't you the lad who was in the tournament? Yes, sir. Claude faced Dia's in the finals. Yes, I saw it. You almost had it, too. I really, it really wasn't that. Dia said you are quite skilled. We're looking, we're all looking forward to the future tournaments. Future? Nah, I'm not gonna be in future tournaments, dude. I'm, I, I uh, for all, I, I think I'm actually probably almost done with the first game, because there's a lot in this game, a lot of cutscenes and whatnot. So, and back then, you know, the discs didn't hold that much space, but yeah. The sword I forged. He said it would suit you. Dia said that? He's he's that kind of lad who's too shy to say things like that to your face. And I should get a stone edge or some sharp edge, something like that. Yeah, he accepts me as my rival! That's what I was thinking before anyways. Yep, sharp edge. St sharp edge. This is this is the item you need plus two mithrals to get the best one of the best weapons in the game. So now that that said, um, in order to do that, you do need customization and two mithrals. And in order to do that, um, there's a chance when you uh, upgrade this sword, it will become the minus sword. And if it becomes the minus sword, save your game and then go to the customization again. And there's a chance that that will become the eternal sphere or so some something like that. Some ridiculously awesome um, thing that has a lot of attack power. But... Anyways, I'm going to end it here. Um, next time, we're going to be going to Linga. And also, very soon, I can get my next character, which might be the final character that I use. I'm not sure. It really depends on what other characters I can get. Um, this game is really confusing, and I, 
and I, I, I don't know. This game is just really confusing and it kind of frustrates me a little bit. I might change Selena for somebody else because of the fact that she's really annoying to use. But we'll see what happens. So thank you all for watching. And um, I apologize if this episode ends up being really long. We'll see during the editing process. But thank you all for watching. And until next time, don't forget to rub the rubber ducky.